All right, guys, we're ready for step two in the Insight Genesis mapping. Now, what you want to do is go to gofreemarine.com right up here. Once you get in there, you're going to go to Products, Insight Genesis, and you can go into Overview. And Overview is where you're going to sign up. So if you have not or don't know anything about it, go there, sign up, it is free. So this is a really nice tool to have. Uh, this, like it says, make your own maps. So you can spend as much or as little time as you want to make your own mapping. You can uh, go in and do a social mapping. Everybody else is putting their uh, sonar log data into it and everybody can go in there and click off of it download if they have got enough on there if they've got a map that's completely covered if not you can go in there and keep it private that allows you to create uh, mapping with vegetation uh, bottom hardness you can have your contour lines all in one and it just gives you a little bit more uh, range I guess and a more detailed map so you can go in and purchase and that will also be plan and pricing down here so to get started once you get signed up you will go in you can either go to the overview and log in or you can go to my account which will also allow you to log in and once you get logged in, you will show something like this. This is your dashboard. This is your uploads. This is where you can merge. And over here, you've got your social mapping. So you can go to social mapping and dial in to where you want to go. Or you can go to list and you can put in all the info you need. Or you can go and put in whatever lake it is and go directly to that lake or if there's other lakes named the same. So now we've got our card here and what you'll do is you'll come over here to web upload. Now if you are running a Windows then you can do the install uh, Insight Genesis upload tool. Now I've got a Mac, so we're going to use the web upload. And from there, you are going to. Uh, why is it doing that? Let's go. There we go. All right. Now you'll go add sonar logs. <laughs> And then from here, you'll pull off your uh, card. I'm going to click this one and choose and start upload. Terms, conditions, start upload. Now, while this is uploading, you do need to stay on this page right here. You do need to stay on here until it is uploaded. So do not leave or it will cancel. Once you're uploaded, you'll go back to your dashboard, and it's going to take a little bit of time. You will get an email from uh, Inside Genesis letting you know that they have received it and they have uh, put the data together and they'll send it back to you. Then you'll go back into your uh, dashboard, click on My Uploads, and there you will see all your sonar logs. You can view each one of those separately, go through your trip, you can add waypoint. All right, now that we're back to the dashboard, let's go ahead and wind this out. You'll be able to click on your dashboard and you'll be able to see that your logs have been uploaded. Now, mine that I just did have not been uploaded just yet so I will go ahead and show you on these 
what you can do once yours gets uploaded. Now, as I was saying earlier, we've got data offset. Here is where you will put in, uh, like I've done here, I put in two feet. A positive two means that the lake would be below, two foot below normal. Now, if it was above normal because of uh, due to uh, large amounts of water, rain, what have you, coming into it, then you're going to do a negative two or negative one or three, however many it's above. So right now, Sooner's a couple feet below. So I just put in two and um, then once you do that, you're going to save it. And once you save it, it's going to send it back to uh, Inside Genesis for them to adjust everything and then you'll get the results back. Uh, now, as I was saying before, you can also go in and let's go one more. You can go in and mark waypoints. Let's get a All right, so if you would want, you go in, double click, or in y'all's case, you could uh, right click, <coughs> excuse me, and then you're gonna click on that little icon right there and mark uh, hump, save. Now that puts a waypoint right there. <laughs> So once you get all your logs done and you do go in and download the, the map, then at that point you will be able to, we'll go ahead and delete that one. Okay. Uh, once you download your map, you will have all your waypoints that you have put in there. And also when you do, you can make notes. If there's something in particular about that waypoint, uh, brush or whatever you could even put in there what time it was just pretty much whatever you want to do now there's also trends which tells you water temperature your wind air temperature everything so this will kind of give you a little idea of what happened during that trip as well uh, it'll keep a mark on there for you so I'll go back. Oops. There's my uploads. And we're going to go view trip. Merge trip. Now, if I want to go ahead and mark them all on there, which we will, we'll go ahead and click the top one and that'll do them all. Now if you want to only do certain ones then you're going to go through and just click which ones you want to do. I want you to do that. Click there. Now this is where you're going to get you want to include, include and your contours you can do one foot, three foot, five foot, ten foot or you can do all. and merge. Now this is the same thing as you can see there. You'll receive an email when the merge trips finish processing. So <clears throat> just like when you're uploading everything you do, every time you want to change any kind of data on this, you do your changes, you save it or merge it, upload it, whatever. It goes to them and then they will adjust everything send you an email letting you know that it is complete and then you can go back and get in there and you will have your complete uploads. So next thing will be to actually download that to your card so you can install it into your 
uh, fish finder and then use the maps and like I'd said before I am running HDS 7 uh, Gen 2 I have one that I run at the console itself so uh, you know uh, it may be a little bit before I get to the part where I download uh, my logs to that one to create my map so once I do I will do a video of that um, but until then I'll go through this if there's any questions or if you have any comments or if there's anything else y'all want to see just uh, leave a comment below let me know and if this helped you out and if uh, if you liked it just uh, give me a thumbs up and please subscribe and just uh, have fun out there and uh, catch some fish guys